And people might be thinking, well, maybe it's just because uh, the nature walk was just more pleasant. They just liked the nature walk more. And people did tend to like the nature walk more. Um, and we did measure improvement in mood. How much did mood improve on the walk? We didn't find very strong correlation between improvements in mood and improvements in the working memory and directed attention performance, suggesting that people weren't just getting better because they were getting into good moods. But the even stronger demonstration that this wasn't mood-driven is that we had people walk at different times of the year. So some of our participants walked in June when it was like 80 degrees Fahrenheit. People said, Mark, I can't believe you're paying me to go for a walk in nature. Really healthy mood benefits, really healthy working memory and attention benefits. We also had participants walk in January, 25 degrees Fahrenheit. People said, Mark, I was freezing my butt off out there. I did not enjoy that walk. But incredibly, the people that walked in January when it was freezing cold and they didn't enjoy the walk obtained the same working memory and attention benefits as the people that walked in June. So you didn't even have to like the nature interaction to get this directed attention benefits.